of neighborhood versus neighborhood. We got CND in the cream jerseys in the yellow gold jerseys. Taliban, Taliban gonna win the jer the tip off right now. Bear with me with the cream and the yellow jerseys. I like the bell out look from his shot coming up. No good as that one coming from Spray. Just missing it. He's trying to let it spray, tried to get to his spot in the mid range. Love the way he got to the spot, just wasn't able to knock down the shot, Maz. Now here's Nas with the ball. Nas gonna set up the big man down low. Let's see what he's got with it. Coming with it. Old school fade away from Matt. No good. Good rebound coming out. CND with some hustle boards. Can't connect on the three point shot coming back the other way. Taliban, spray with the ball, gonna hand it over to the big fella, Ron. Ron trying to get that ISO one on one, floats it up, no good. The tip rebound ended up with Matt. Maz, if we learn two things from yesterday, two things are very important here today. Free throws and defensive rebound. Well, how about floaters there? Because Joe just took on two defenders of the Taliban squad and floated right over them. First bucket of the game, 2-0 oh currently. God. And a deep shot coming there from Twist. As the cream team wasting no time. Can't get it to go, though. You got to watch it. The rims with the double rim. Unforgiven, as we said all yesterday. We were not kidding. We played on it a little bit today. Yeah, I was giving you that work, Mask. You did give me that work. I will admit when I got that out match. And here's Bob with the pull up. No good. And again, CND doing work on the boards. Coming up the board, Joe. What about it? Get that screen from Matt. Gonna take the three ball, two short on it. That's gonna be Ron on the rebound. Easy outlet. Not the ball, but that's all right because it ends up going in. You can count that for two. And we are all tied up at deuces. Nice job there from Spray. Nice job for Spray. Again, getting out in transition. That's the number one thing you gotta do, and you gotta convert. I mean, you clearly saw it last time and yesterday at opening night. They weren't, there were teams that weren't able to convert in the transition. And a slip ends up a loose ball. RJ coming up the court. Trying to take it all the way, can't get it going, and a foul coming in from behind as Joe trying to get that block. And again, that's just great defense, right? I mean, both teams feel like they're evenly matched when it comes to size, right? I, I think when you look at the big man down low, you got number one here, and number, number one, uh, Ron, and then you got go ahead, number zero, Matt. I mean, both of them match up really well there, and uh, when you look at the around the court, everything's matched up evenly, right? I mean, with the other matches we saw, there was a lot of mismatches. Oh, good spin move coming. Nice touch there coming from Twist. And you can see why he's got the name with it. Putting him in the cycle. Little spin cycles. A little floater up top. Beautiful move. CND getting back after it. The big fella Joe up top. Cash money. That's too much space. Too much space. No hand in the face all day, every day. Twist going to take us back up the court here for Taliban. And ooh, a silky smooth jumper there. You see, no hesitation. Just getting the motion, getting the rhythm off the dribble. I mean, if you're going to leave my man wide open, he's going to take the shot every time. Too easy, man. Come on now. DeMar DeRozan would be proud of that attempt for sure. Coming back down with it, Nas. Nice pass out to the wing with it. Chase going to send it to the corner. Cookies. Thank you. Back with Nas, but Nas getting stripped from it, and it is, in fact, Cookies. That's the gold squad coming back up with it. Quarter three. No good. No good with it. That's a big man rebound coming from Phil. I like the shot attempt, though. Man. What, what Taliban is doing a great job of is getting out in transition and finding the open shots, and they're doing a great job so far. Chase with the ball, going to put it down to the corner with Joe. Joe, seeing what space he's got, a little step back, count it. His shot is too nice with it. I mean, Matt is doing his thing right now. He is really getting to his spot on the court. So again, Twist going to have it. Going to send it up around. Going to receive the screen and get it back. Blister in defense. He chucks it up. Couldn't get the friendly bounce with it. CND taking it the other way with nods. Again, bad shot attempt, but just great defense. Tipping it out with it. Spray coming up the court. Take it on two from CND. As Joe getting a hand on in there. 
And again, you see the speed coming into play, right? Stamina's coming into play. Speed's coming into play. They're getting out in transition and doing the right thing. Taliban, I like what they're doing so far. I mean, very close game, though, to start off. I mean, you see these teams really go out and get on runs. But right now, both teams are evenly matched. For sure. And I, I want to take a, a, the chance to correct myself. It's been Matt with the silky smooth shots. The big fellow, you can notice him with the bald head. Uh, Great, can't leave him too much space. He's got a good handle, uh, just an old school jumper. He makes it count. A great player for the CND squad. Ron now trying to take that on, and a cleanup crew coming in from Twist. That's a good effort. And offensive rebounds gonna be the number one important. And we're the number one thing here, Mass. No second chance points, but if you're gonna get the second chance points, convert on them. Joe gonna take it to the corner, pass back up top. And that one way off, just gonna find the mark. It was Marvin. Try to get Turn over. Try to get out and transition a little too early. And Matt coming in, trying to hit that Euro, but good quick hands coming from Ron. Knocks that one out, but it's gonna stay with CND. Yeah, I think both teams have the scouting report to hear today, Mass. I mean, you clearly see both teams know exactly what's going on here. Great defense on both sides. This game. is gonna be a fun one. This is gonna be fun. Yuri with the ball now, trying to post up down low. Looking at pass out off, just takes the shot himself. Kick it to Riley. Good offensive boards coming in. And of course, the main man, Matt, with the book back. I mean, you can't have three defenders go away from the basket right there for a rebound. Unbelievable. Vaughn taking a lot of contact as he dribbles in. Yeah, and I want to talk about that last shot a little bit. I mean, you had three players from CND right there crashing the boards right away while three defenders were trying to, you know, contest the shot. You got to be able to get more rebounds on that play. Do not let up offensive rebounding. That's the big part of here today. And we'll get a, our first uh, some substitutions coming in here as Zay is going to check in. Twist. Jay. Gonna take it all the way. That's just too much space. Let him go to work tough with it. Match got a right nice touch around the rim. You gotta get some help defense over there. A shot to that left hand, man. You gotta be able to use that left hand in that zone. Get it away from the defender. Great shot by Twist. Shot coming from Joe. No good. And of course, Twist getting on all of the stat sheets right now. Ron taking it all the way. Again, can't finish. It's too much contact down low. So he taking it and he turns it over. Three on one. Three on one. Three Three on one. Three Three one. Oh. The big block from Matt. Ron get it down low in the post. Take it on three of them. CSP. Got to get a little more height to compete with him. Yeah, I mean, Matt can't do it all on his own, man. Great block, but you need your defenders to come back. 12. It's going to be some air with the ball. 12 9. 12 9 is the score. Swing it around the perimeter is CND in the cream jersey. Posting up down low. Oh, that's the ground. And Ron, you can count that. Marvin Worthy going to work. Yeah, I'll take those all day. Go ahead, let this smack come in. But let me get my bucket while I'm at it. So we got 405, 12, 211 right now. Substitution, substitution. We're going to have Marvin Worthy. Substitution. Looks like we're going to have a sub come in. Heading here for CND. Nas will be coming in for CND right now. Haven't seen Nas here today, but let's see what he can do. So worthy. First shot is First shot. And the only shot because it was an one, but that is a good offensive rebound from Samir. Back out. Joe swinging it. Nice jumper just short. Offensive boards are out here, though. Too strong with it. Another offensive board. Taliban got to get better at boxing out here. Yeah, I mean, second chance points will be the deciding factor in these games. And again, you got to crash the points. You got to box out. Oh, Twist with spin. Oh, my God. I see why they call him Twist. Are you spin. Is that Twist, twist or is that John Wall? I'm not sure right there. That was insane. Joe with the pass to it. And a big block coming. But they're calling a foul on Twist. Yeah, I mean, that. Wow. I mean, I just want to get back to that last play, though. Twist your body. Perfect positioning right to the basket. Unreal. Substitution on the next shot. Substitution. Got a little bit of the hand on it. We're going to have a sub right after this. It's going to be two shots here coming from Marvin Worthy. We outside. 
back to the lawn. Yeah, he's gonna miss Still the first free throw. He's gonna miss the first free throw, man. Yeah, we saw yesterday how free throws are gonna be back, like factored into this game. And another thing, you see how close this game is. In the first quarter, I don't think he's been a single game as close as this one so far. And it's gonna be like this all day long. You got that right for sure. So now Ron gonna take it up the court. Him and Twist been doing a bulk of the work for Taliban. Uh -huh. Trying to get two, two, two. some swing into action. Shot good, coming no man. good. That one from Zay. Loose money with the hops though, Maz. He tried to get up there and do that putback. Samir back up top. Taking it, hit it. And that is a Juco national champion, people. That one just could not find the mark. And listen, down at the court, it's beautiful one facilities one that we got down one here. One that out. double rim. If you are not on the money, you're not getting a friendly roll most of the time. Yeah, I have to agree with you on that one. You're not going to get the friendly roll. You got to be a, a spot up, absolute consistent shooter like I am, Maz, to be able to make shots like that. Uh -huh. uh, well, you Where proved it going? today, so I'm not uh -huh. even going to bust you on that one, my yeah, friend. And we're going to have a defensive paint, three seconds. You, you cannot be paint. down in the paint that low unless you got a body on you. Paint, and I understand they were trying the to overcompensate the way that Ron's been able to use his height and throw his outside. body around. But you still, you either got to trap it or get away from it. You're going to get called with that every time. The rest have been quality down here. Again, when you have these free throws, you got to take advantage. And now Ron's going to miss this one. It's definitely not what you need right now. You've got to be able to hit your free throws. Because every block. point matters. I, Mass, I think when we get to the fourth quarter, this game's going to be neck and neck. I got a weird feeling about this. You guys better stay tuned if you're watching this one. Well, if it's like anything else that we've seen, it's been good competition down here. Big fella Ron making the shot on the arm. And he's going to end up back to the line. Got to watch out with that foul trouble, you know what I'm saying? It's a fine to get back into the next game. We already saw it last night. A tech came in. You got to pay $50 if that comes to even get back into the game. So you got to manage your fouls and situations a lot more as opposed to being in, say, the NBA. Yeah, I mean, we saw it with Lucky yesterday for free agency. They took on north side and were able to get a win. Good thing they paid that as soon as possible, and Lucky was able to come back in, and free agency was able to get a convincing win over the defending champ, north side. Yeah, no, it was definitely a... Uh, uh, a good tough game for the second game that we saw, but that number one game between, uh, help me out here, bigger and F -A -A -F -A -F -A -F AFN. Thank you. AFN showed some quality defense with it. That's just what we're They're bringing you. Definitely be a team to watch out for, man. I I gotta agree on that part. AFN is gonna be a powerhouse for sure. Here today. Beautiful day down here, about 90 degrees down on this court. Is that one going out with it? Tip ball ensuing after the miss layup attempt from Sin. I love this that. This is going to go right out of there. bounds, and I believe it's going Taliban way. That's a great play by Taliban right there. Hit it right off a defender. And let that ball go out of bounds. It's just, just good IQ. It's like Montclair State's Kieran Flanagan. Just make it smart plays. Sometimes you just got to make smart plays with it. And now he with the ball going to pass it off into the corner with Spray. Spray trying to post up with some good post defense. Take it on him. Tip drill and suing rebound coming, and that's going to be Samir coming away with it. Quality big man defense down low coming from CND. I mean, Moose Money. Oh, and that's a steal right there. And Samir losing it. Spray a slide. taking it. Oh, foul coming in though with it. And Spray trying to rip down the rim on that one, trying yeah. to take flight like a G6. Yeah, take flight like a G6. Wow, that was a good one. But tried to take flight right there. Had a, again, another transitional take. But again, smarter to foul in these situations. Free throws are not guaranteed, especially with the double rim. Smart foul by CND right there. You know what? It's, it's They say it's easy, it's free points, but you got to convert at it, man. You, you can't take it for granted. Yeah, definitely not free in these situations. I'll say that. But it's free for Spray right there. It is Spray will take his Spray. one. As they increase their lead, Taliban currently up 17-13. With a chance to tack it on to 18. I like how well-balanced Taliban is when it comes to size, defense, and I just want to see a little bit more shooting from them from downtown. But so far, they look like a really balanced team. And again, when you're balanced, you're consistent. That's something I really want to see here today. CND trying to get the offense going again. Screen coming up top. Shot. Deep two. No good. Oh, tip right back to Spray. Spray going to set it down to Ron. Ron at home down low. Missing it. Puts it back up. No foul coming in yet. And a big rebound coming in for CND. As that was Nas with it. 
You're going to see Bama taking it all the way, but Bama taking some contact, and he's going to get a chance to the line now. The other thing I'm liking from CND right now is that they are crashing. It does not matter who is under the paint. Do not give them a free layup or a bucket. Great job to get down there. Was there maybe a foul? Maybe. But at the end of the day, do what you can. I mean, this is street ball rules. It's not as easy as it's going to be. Yep, it's not going to be sure. easy they, oh, are they on? You gotta tell some. The the scoreboard isn't on. Or, I don't know that. Shot clock. Oh, my bad. You know. So anyway, we got Bama. We got Bama down out here, and we we appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Just making sure that the shot clock working. Shout out the refs making up extra duty today. Our shot clock not it, but the scoreboard still with us. You can see our beautiful scoreboard cam. And Spray gonna take us back down into the paint. And that ball gonna go out of bounds, but it's gonna be staying Gold Taliban way. Yeah, a little pickpocket there from Brandon. Good pickpocket right there. Again, no easy points when you're getting to the basket. Spray looks like the most balanced player on this team, I would say. He definitely gets to a mid-range. He definitely gets to the basket. And it loves playing one-on-one, -on -one, as I can already see here today. So definitely got to try to make it hard for him today. Speaking of loving playing one-on-one, -on -one, oh, great pass coming from Ron, but the finish just not there for Moose Money. CND, that with Brandon going to pass it up top, switch three, no good. And that one's going to go out of bounds. Taliban going to take over 18-13 with 59 and a half seconds remaining here in quarter numero uno. I, I, I saw Swiss has that jump shot right there. Should he just, oh, wait a minute. Uh, that's that's a one way to get a good foul with it. And, and you see, I believe that was Moose Money just sneaking on it over to the other side. And nobody really paid attention. There's a weird feeling on this court right now. You know, it, it's... It's the afternoon, people just get out of work, you know, the sun's just getting down. And I feel like the teams are just getting warmed up. We're still feeling each other out right now. Sure, we're even just getting warmed up. You know what I mean? We're just getting snow. No, you got that right. But, I mean, you clearly see Taliban is, is, is just on it right now. I mean, they're not snoozing. They're taking every opportunity they can. But, unfortunately, they're missing free throws right there. But I just want to say this. I mean, you look at Moose Money, right? I mean, who's the number one person that comes to your mind when you look at Moose Money? Terry Rozier. He looks exactly like him. I mean, you can't, you can't tell me you don't look like Terry Rozier. Does he play like him? We'll see here today. It is a good comparison. You know, we, we've seen some styles in game. Uh, take some kind of a, a, a development with it. But I'll tell you, the way that he's playing defense and the length that he has, it kind of reminds me a little bit of Isaac Bonga a little bit. Isaac Bonga. Wow, what a name right there. He's playing for the Lakers. I have not seen him take a jump shot, which is, uh, that's what Bonga was doing, you know what I'm saying? But he's been attacking the rim. He's been getting after it. Will it take the contact? That's a physical player right there. Isaac Bonga, man. Yep. Wow. That is, a, that is a player right there. All right, well, then the West Taliban's going to have the ball here. Twist has got the ball now. One on one, gets a fake screen from Oh, Moose, look at money. the handles. Oh, just leaving it short, though. Grabs his own rebound. Taking on three CND. Loose ball and Sue and CND coming away with it down the other side of the court. And it's going to be Synth missing it. Grabbing his own rebound, putting it back up, getting the friendly roll. And finally, you can count that on. 12 seconds, 19 15. And the yellow jerseys, Taliban has the lead and they'll have the last possession, it looks. As it's Zay, five seconds on the shot clock. He's double teamed, passes out. You got to shoot it. Putting it up, no good. That's going to be the end of the first quarter here. 19 to 15 in favor of the yellow jerseys, known as Taliban. They've been getting after it, man. They've been getting after it. I like what I've saw from Twist here today, though. I mean, the way he's able to get to his spots on the court, the way he's able to get to the basket, Twist in his body in, in, in different ways where a defender doesn't even know what he's doing. Unbelievable there from Twist on Taliban's side. But when I look at CND, I think, again, they're just a great balanced team, right? Defense has been a big part of them. The, the one thing is, I mean, we've seen it with, with Bigger yesterday, they got to convert on these fast break situations. You get your steals, you get your turnovers, but go on the other end and convert on it. And I think that's what CND's looking to do right now. I mean, like you said, first quarter, you're just getting warmed up. The sun's out. First game of the day. Third game of even the season, but first game for them of the season. It's it's going to be tough sledding, I'll say that. And, and watch out for the big fella battle. I mean, no, number zero on CND, Matt, has got a silky smooth shot. He plays like an old school basketball player, just fundamentals and, and a cool jump shot. And on the other side, his counterpart, number one, Ron, uh, dominating down low, getting some offensive boards, getting to that one-on-one -on -one post positioning and dominating from it. And 
Watch out for Ron for Taliban and watch out for Matt for CND. I think the two big fellas are going to be going at it all game long. I love that matchup, man. The two heavy hitters going at it. You already see Matt earlier on when he was in the game. He was getting to where he needed to go. And, I mean, you look at Ron on the other side. That's a menace, too. He's not afraid to go ahead and get another rebound. He's not afraid to go get a put back. Let me go get the ball. Let me get fouled. It doesn't matter what I do. I'm just going to go ahead and get a win out here for my team. And that's what I like from Ron on that side. And then the last looks like we're going to get here back into the second quarter of action. But again, I, I think Taliban's doing a good job. I think both teams are doing a good job. This game's going to be close. It's going to be a battle. And I'm excited for this season, man. It's going to be super exciting. Neighborhood versus neighborhood. Summer League. You're definitely not going to want to miss any games here. I mean, night one was crazy, right? And here we are. Night two. Close game, 19-15. We're getting quality games. This is what neighborhood and neighborhood's all about. It's also about coming together, bridging gaps between the neighborhoods, you know, coming together, lower crime, lower violence, and, and celebrate the beautiful game of basketball. That's right. It's a beautiful game indeed, Maz. And being out here, beautiful sun, Branchwood Park, you wouldn't want to be anywhere else, Maz. Absolutely not. Once again, MJ Hooper Crew and all abilities live. I'm Brandon Maz Marazzo, joined by Khalil Callaway. Second quarter, getting underway right here with CND having the possession. And that's Sid taking it all the way. Sid with the roll and count it. That's just a, too much of a runway for him. You got to close out. And Taliban waiting. Said no time, but they missed it. It's Matt on the rebound. Coming up the court, Samir. National champion. Samir Overcome surveying. Me. Looking for some options. He's going to get a screen from Matt. Use it, pops it, and just over to the left. With a great offensive rebound from Joe. Put back. Again, I like what I've seen from CND here. I think they're going to give him up to the money seal. Oh, we play some defense now. Still going to be Taliban ball, but I like what I've seen from CND right now. Samir right getting to the basket. Little Euro step, step through, left hand, layup, beautiful. And another put back, getting a great rebound. I like what I'm seeing from CND. So Ron going to try to pick up the pace a little bit. Oh, and just going to get the friendly roll to fall. The offensive rebound in the ensuing. That's going to be a jump ball. And that's all Matt right there, man. I mean, alternating that shot clearly. Again, that, that frame that he's got, the height that he's got to be able to get up there and alter that shot, it's tough for Ron to be able to finish that one. So we're going to get Samir for CND and twist for Taliban on the jump ball here. I'm taking twist on this one. Shots He's got the height for sure. He took that right to a three-point shot. But grabs the miss. The twist has been all over the place. That is a stat sheet stuffer, my friend. I mean, he does it all, man. I mean, that's just a, a natural ball play. You go out and do whatever you need him to do. Twist again. Oh, my God. You see, penetrate with the right shoulder and able to pull back with it, create that space through the contact, and nail it home. I'm going to say pause before I say this, but the way that he moves his hips and twists his body towards the basket, unbelievable. Some man trying to take it, take it to fall with it. Good defense coming in, ball with defense. But again, that showing off that perimeter defense. Give it up to speed, but a nice recovery from him. Vaughn. Bro, shake and bake action down low, and Matt again adjusting the shot with the put back for Moose Money. Moose Money, get into the money, get into the put back, get another bucket for Taliban. 23-19, CND. Got to get some offensive possessions to flow. Oh, my God, God. How about Sin coming in there like a synthesizer? Just and it. In and out. Making little music and in motion right there. out. Reverse lay. Oh, my God. God. Again, a block party is unsuited right now for Matt. Samir, good ball movement. Oh, and a little reverse action comes out. Couldn't get it. But a nice hustle play from Samir to keep the possession alive. Cross court with the pass over to Synth. Synth recocking it back. Kick it to fall. And no foul call, but Joe converts. John Cena told me to never give up, and neither did CND right there. Not giving up on that basket. And look, they're fighters, man. They're dogs out here competing, and now we got a tie game once again. Hustle low to respect. It's what it's all about, my friend. Shot coming. Matt closing out on it. Just too much for twist to handle, it seemed like. Good outlet pass coming. And that. Looked like he could have been tipped, but actually just ends up kind of being a, a, a little yeah, just foggy just mind there, just throws it out of bounds. Outside. And that's going to be a turnover coming. And it's going to be Taliban taking over the possession. Just We're tied up at 23-23, Jordan. 
It's moving too fast, man. Got to slow the pace down Shot to make down. basketball feel comfortable. RJ, short on the attempt. That rebound coming from Phil. Yeah. Phil over to Sid. And Sid just too smooth with it. I like what I see from Sid. He's able to sneak that ball in. Oh, almost a steal. Oh. Could have been a good mark. Yeah, I'll tell you, with Tyler, I, I think if Chris would have thrown that between the legs, he, he could have got him on the nutmeg. Yeah, that would have been insane. I'm not going to lie. That would have been absolutely insane. So the ball going to stay with Taliban. We got spray on the throw. 6.49. Left in the half, 23.25 in favor of CND. Champion. And a big block back. again coming from Mad Man. I mean, he just has great position. He understands this game too well. And a foul. Phil's got to put that one up there, man. Right for Matt. He's wide open. He's trying to sneak it around the defender's bag. It's not the way you're going to do it. That's too big for you not to throw that ball up, man. Yeah, Khalil, you read my mind on that one. Uh, if he would have just thrown it up, you had the height advantage there. I think Matt actually uh, could have just went up and not even come down, would have just slammed it right in. Samir with it. One dribble. Sin, trying to get it in. Oh, my God. He showed off the layup package. Now he's showing off the mid-range game. And that's and that's a way to start to get a feel for the game, man. I mean, once you take a shot like that, you're feeling good. I don't know about that one. That one looked a little rushed there from Heem. Lost his dribble a little bit. Oh, off the backboard. The Taliban right on top of the saying, you're not making us look stupid like that. Okay. Oh, pass to Bob. Good pass coming to Bob. Bob could have went up with it, but saw Matt coming. That's a good look and an easy open three. That is ball movement, ladies and gentlemen. RJ with the dumb shot. He's been looking for that wing shot right there on the left right there. He's been looking for it. He just knocks one down right there. I'm going to see a lot of that today. And they take the lead, 28-27. Let's see oh. if Sandy has anything to say about it. Sid couldn't get it to go. He wanted the foul, but they don't give it to him. He had a case for it, though. RJ called back. This one staying in there from Twist. Nice pass, no look. Oh, count it, spray, what an assist. That is a low pass, beautiful, right, right in the needle, where you needed to go. And a great man rising up for there. That was fantastic. That was, that was that was insane. Possibly the best pass we've seen in these two days. Oh, and that, that one just looks at it. Spray saw that all day. Doesn't got to be flashy as long as it's effective. But RJ scores the lap. 32 27. 5 10 remaining. And CND is going to take a timeout. 5 10 remaining here in half number one. And what are we talking about? Defense leads to offense. And, and on that time, a spray was on top of everything. Starting that fast break, and then just textbook passing. You got to cover it. Come off the top of the glass and come on it. As long as you make it, that's fine. No need to be flashy. It's all about winning. You got, it's not about winning this game. You have a whole season for the month of August coming. And I'm sorry, the month of August is alive. End in August, try to get that 20 year championship. You know what it is? That's, that's absolutely all about, man. Get to the money, get to the play, man. That's all that matters to me. If I'm on this court right now, I'm doing what I need for my team to win. And honestly, if I'm CMD right now, I'm, I'm relying on anybody to go ahead and score. Because they got a lot of good guys out there, man. I, mean, I like what I see from Samir. I like what I see from Sid. I like what I see from Matt. Even Chuck, I mean, he's just a good thing. He's great. Getting out of the transition. I would like to see them get back to the passing that we saw. It was a little off. Pinball actually hit the points with it. Almost, I want to say a triangle offense, but you know what I'm saying? Getting that motion with it. And, and then you come with it, but you, you can't be running a bounce pass. And you three defenders like that, it's going to be a turnover every time. Stay with it. Going to pass it out top with Heem. Heem's three, even though contested. Cash money from up top. And letting that Heem fly, baby. No hesitation from Heem right there. Great shot. Right. It's going right into your spot, too. That's that's the big thing here on these threes. Swizz, the lefty, couldn't respond. But a great offensive board. But I'll take Samir's got to hang out of the ball a little better than this one. A couple of turnovers already. All the way, but it's blocked. That's great. Hustle coming. And it's going to be Swizz pulling up. He wants it back. Couldn't get it, but Matt there with the offensive board. 
Joe gonna take it. No good, but the offensive board still set. Swift. No foul. And Rob with it. The rebound, outlet pass, coming good spin, finish. Couldn't get it, but who's there? The main man, twist. The leading score for Taliban today is doing it again. Going ahead again, the put back, second chance. Boys, he is, he is just absolutely dominating on this court today. Swiss. What about it? Gonna go back to Matt. I would like to see Matt get some more offensive touches he's, here. He's out of bounds. I'm not gonna call him out on it. Snipped it on the line. Ron gave up that space on purpose. It seemed like wanted him to take that path, knowing he could force him out on it. High IQ play on defense. Again, what CND needs to do right now is stop focusing on the three point shot. I mean, you've had three on one fast breaks. Get to the basket. And I, and I think that's a maybe a common thing in basketball. When you're down by three, you want to just go for the third. Everybody want to be Curry. Seven. Everybody want to be Curry, but in situations, you don't need to be like him, right? I mean, double rim, it's no joke. Get to the basket, get your easy layup, take your two, and go home. Oh, oh and a force oh, error there it's coming like, from doing? Zay. Swift you know. taking all the way. Oh, and a great nah, recovery nah, coming in. And Zay said, no, 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 no. You, I mean, you might have got the turnover, but you got to go up faster and stronger than that. That was too weak. Yeah, my pops would have told me to do push-ups right there. Go up with the left. Left, man had a wide open lane on that left side no way he would have been able to get to that one to block it and cnd's just leaving way too much fast break points on the line they're down 10 right now they got a final offensive rhythm and they got to convert on those fast breaks make it easy on yourself matt getting the inbound pass gonna pass it up top with joe joe coming around to the top of the key and again, here you see that triangle offense trying to come with it. Matt, he's hit one. Couldn't get it, though. Again, living and dying by the three right now. And it's just not going their way. Oh, and a jump ball. And suing right there. Some fast hands. Good job by CND. Yeah, I mean, good job by CND here. But at the end of the day, they keep going at that three-point shot, man. But honestly... Taliban's giving it to him. And I think rightfully so. Is that the strategy you go with in, in the neighborhood versus neighborhood summer league in general? Do you let that three point fly? Unless you play as now it's gonna send that one out of bounds. Out of bounds. As that took us down just a little bit. We good. 305 remaining here in half number one, 10 point game in favor of Taliban. Some motion, getting a wide open shot for Zay up top. He cashes in from the top of the three-point line. Too smooth with it. Uh, CND trying to answer here. Nice screen, but to nowhere, a hard jumper. They're not making it easy on themselves. Fast break coming. This is what I'm talking about. The twist couldn't get it going, but recovers. Ron attempting the dunk, couldn't get it to flow. Nas taking some contact. That's going to be a travel and a turnover coming. You got to put the ball on the court before taking that step. We back here live on all abilities. Sorry about that. We had a little technical difficulties on my end. I'm just out here doing repair, man. I'm trying to fix everything I can, man. 39, 27, 2, 18. on the clock. Taliban. Zay with the ball now. Pass it on over. Up top, RJ shot off to the right. And that's going to be a turnover going the other way. And Taliban right now, they got a good lead. 12 point lead. Internet went out.
All right, and we are back here live. We apologize. DePaul took out our Wi-Fi out of all the places to hit. But Swizz going to give it to Matt, trying to pass down low to Nas. You see how quick we did that, though? You see how quick we're good with that, man? One thing goes down, but we're ready to we're ready to combat that. We're ready to go, baby. We're just that good. All abilities live. NJ Hooper crew, we do it the best out we, 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 we got adversity we got to deal with sometimes. It happens. RJ with the ball now. 140 left on the shot clock. Here in half number one. Wow. Going to give it over to the other yeah. side with it. And Spray going to try and slow things down. Corner three no, from no, Moose Money. No good. Swiss trying to push the pace. Yeah, taking on two. He gets... Stripped by Spray. Spray coming the other way. That's Spray right. trying to give it up to Swizz. He keeps the possession alive and finishes it the three CND players. Never give up. And oh, look at that. Moose Money trying to get another steal there for himself. But man, Taliban is just crashing the boards at all costs. Doing what they need to do to go ahead and get this victory. And right now, they're in the driver's seat. They are on cruise control right now. Yeah, it coach is not happy for CND right now. I wouldn't be either, to be honest, but that's not, it's not coach's fault. CND's fault. Got a minute left here in half number one. Joe with the ball. And again, I. I think to go with the wrong pass, the bounce pass. When you got three, four Taliban jersey circling, and you got a big man down low in the center, you got to put that high one and he can get it. Don't make the game more difficult. Don't pass the ball. Get a few screens. Get a few off-ball screens, right? Try to get this game facilitated. Joe wide open. I never get it. Matt sits back out to him. Joe coming in. Good pass down low. The big fella, Yuri, might be a game changer that they've been looking for. And a nice finish. Other way, RJ trapped down low in the corner, using his muscles, but the ball comes out. Great hands coming from Sliz and go. The three on two, and they're going to go to Yuri. Yuri takes it. Couldn't finish it. Got to be able to get that going. Swiss with the fast hands. Back out to Yuri. Yuri, pass down to Matt. Matt, two hands for safety. It looks like Swiss got to hurt his finger right there trying to get that ball. It's not good for CND right now. He's been their number one playmaker. This should be the last possession here for Taliban. Ten seconds on the clock. We'll see what shot they choose to go with. The crossover coming. Passing out now with Twist. Twist throwing up a prayer. No good. And even though Moose was there with the offensive board, he could not get it back up in time. But we're heading to halftime. Ten-point game, 41-31 in favor of Taliban. And all abilities live. Game number one here for night two. Neighborhood versus neighborhood. Currently got 41 31 game. Currently in favor of Taliban in yellow. CND in the cream. Callaway, what you think about the second half? I think there's a lot to look forward to, man. I mean, the second half is always about that, right? First half, both teams are starting to get more about three points. Jell a little bit for Taliban. What I want to see from Taliban a little more, though, just go ahead and get some more rebounds, man. I want to see more rebounds defensively. CND has been able to get back into this game because of the second chance points. That's what I got to see for Taliban. CND, they just got to work on getting to the basket. If they get to the basket, they can win this game, man. Give the ball to Matt and let him go to work. So now he's going to have the ball. Going to take the screen, pass it off. Here was Samir coming in, and he gets the friendly roll. That's a good touch coming from the Juco champion. That's a great way to stay on that right side. Let that defender be on your left side guard and go ahead and put it up with the right hand. And oh, fast hands from Matt. Matt, oh, with the laps. Got to watch out with the jerseys. Couldn't see it. And the lob pass. Maybe a little sun might have got in his eye. The sun over our back shoulder here. Try to get a little too fancy with it. Just keep it simple, man. I get it. We want to get the flash from the crowd. I know we we on all abilities live right now, but let's calm down a little bit. Let's get some buckets. And Matt coming around the corner, floats it up. Oh, yeah, here we go. And getting back to the first quarter basics. Nice little floater. That's what you need to get back in this game. Cut the gap slowly. They're only down by six now. Zay spinning, putting it up, gets a high five from Matt for his efforts, but more importantly, gets the bucket. Yeah, took advantage of the mismatch with Samir on him, gave him a little floater for his business, trying to extend this lead once again. 
Nas turning the corner trying yeah, to go no. reverse on it and a, a foul coming, but I gotta be honest with you, I didn't even see Ron put his hands up. Yeah, it's just a dumb shot, you know what I mean? It's just a, that was just a dumb shot. But nonetheless, I mean, going ahead, trying to get to the basket, rightfully so, man. I mean, they've been able to tack all day. I just, I would love to see the rest point of view on that. I, I, I did not see hands come up from Ron. Listen, man, you're not the ref. You're right. You know what I mean? You're not taking control of this game. If you were, it'd probably be awful. I don't know about that, but all right. Give me a whistle. Are you kidding me? Give you a whistle? <laughs> I'm getting to the cop car here for giving you a whistle. <laughs> Noise complaint? I know. <laughs> anyway, Nas with the shot after missing the first one. He goes 0 for 2. They got to convert there. Okay. They really are just hurting themselves right now. You want to get back in this game? You got to take your time on your free throws. No bend in the knees. Just just rushed it. Way too much. RJ to twist, twist with the bend of the body. Couldn't get it going. Stay here. That was going out of bounds. And you see Samir not liking that one. He thought he could have saved it, but can we just, touched can it. You we gotta just let the player and get the ball. Can we just talk about the absolute athletic ability of Twist? Just getting himself in these weird scenarios to be able to put shots up like that. Unbelievable. Oh, look at the pass coming in. But some quick hands forcing that one to go down. Ron comes away. With it. And Ron says, no, no, I got this, but couldn't finish. Twist coming back, fighting through, and he'll take a foul to the shoulder. It feels like whenever Talon Man misses a shot, Twist or Ron is right there to get the rebound and take advantage, man. I mean, that's the way they've been able to be up in this game. The second chance points, again, you see the free throws being missed from CND. It just hurts you as you go along. You cannot be down by eight right now, missing free throws. Oh, a little backboard. The bank backboard is open for business. And you know what I like to say? When it's after hours like this, you got to have VIP credit. He's been a VIP player, MVP of the game for me thus far. I can't disagree with you, Maz. He's my MVP for sure on the Taliban side. For the CND side, it's definitely Matt. But I want to see him get the ball a little more and let that double team come and let those three-point shots fly a little more. First one is good. Second attempt coming. Cash it. Cash it, rightfully so. 10 point game once again. Nas being put, picked up at half court by Ron. Ron trying to stick him in his pocket. Forced to pass out from it. Over with Phil. Phil trying to get into the paint. Gonna pass it out with Samir. Samir, guarded by Zay, getting the screen, calls it off. To try and come in, and he gets the foul with it. You saw the help defense trying to come from behind, but slaps the wrist. But I love the switch defense by Taliban. They're communicating there on the court. They're being able to get a defender right in front of anybody's face. And again, if I'm CND right now, gets the basket a little more. Go ahead, get those one-on-one -on -one opportunities because you've been able to convert right when you get to that basket on the right side or the left side. Just under eight minutes here in quarter number three. Ten-point game. Back out. Samir deep three. No good. And Matt keeping it alive as he gets it out with Phil. Phil going to take a mid-ranger. Couldn't get it to fall. Ball tapping out. Hitting on the table. That's going to be out of bounds. We're going Taliban way. Now, can we just appreciate Coach here for saving our iPad right there? You know what I mean? Same. Big save right there. Coming up close. Shout out to, shout out to Coach over here, man. But now let's celebrate ball. As a ref, you should see the iPad. Say you get it over with RJ now. RJ going to be picked up by Nas. Trying to go one on one. Passes out of it. Three point shot. No good. Couldn't get it to fall. I'm not going to lie, man. Taliban's got some shooters. You see the confidence in their jump shot. I mean, you, you see him, right? He's able to really shoot the ball. You see RJ. He's able to shoot the ball. Spray. They got shooters out here who can let it fly, man, with confidence. And Santa going to come in here for Phil. I would like to see them get the big fella Yuri back in this game. I thought they had a lot of success with that. Jumper coming. It's short. Samir grabbing it for CND. And this is their time to redeem themselves, man. You still got a 10 point gap. Go ahead and get to the basket right now. Got to close it. And Samir's got a good touch around the rim, but the, the handle's there. He's been caught the ball up a little bit too much for my liking. And RJ 
Look at the patience. You see Joe trying to close out. He kind of lays it and comes right after the block attempt, drilling it home. I told you, confidence is key, especially in a jump shot. You miss a few, go ahead and keep shooting. Don't worry about it. He keeps shooting. He's got the touch right now. And Synth has already picked up a bunch of fouls on him, and he does right what he's been doing in the first half, right where he left off as he'll be heading back to the free throw line. Yeah, and back to the free throw line. He's been able to have that touch around the basket. Him and Samir in the game is a great touch as well as Matt. I like the combo there. But I want to see Yuri get in the game as well. I think we need a little bit more size down low. And we also just got to shoot the ball better, right? If you see ND, you got to be able to get that touch around the three-point line because right now Taliban is knocking the shots down. And Synth misses the first shot. And again, man, when it rains, it pours. You, you, you got to be able to convert. I know you're down 10 points. I know it's hot out here. But you got to be able to focus up. I mean, you, you drew the foul, and you got to convert on these points. Second shot for him, no good. And they've been struggling from the charity strike. RJ trying to start the fast break. Gonna pull it up, and it's blocked from behind. Good hustle from Joe. Keeping it alive. CND coming the other way. But a missed time pass. Gonna sail out of bounds. Again, missing free throws, right? Again, a big costly turnover like that. These little mistakes start to add up, and there's a reason why it's a three point, 13 point gap right now. And Nas just gotta slow it down a little bit on that pass. They could have got a fast break point there, but the pass just not where it needed to be. Good hands from Nas. Trying to make things uncomfortable, but you gotta watch out with Twist. And Twist drawing the foul. Twist is shifty, man. I mean, he's got a complex game. I gotta be honest with you. He'll take his time, and then, you know, he's got this, this awkward speed. I can't describe it. That, that first step that he takes, it's just awkward, but it's fast, and it's, it's hard to stop. It's really hard to stop, and that's why he's had a lot of success today. One getting to the basket, one getting second chance points and now getting to the free throw line. Yeah, it looks like Swiss is going to miss the first free throw. Got to convert on these free throws, man. Especially you want to put this game away, you want to put him in the coffin, you got to knock down your free throws. 6.25 here in quarter number three on the clock. 48.35, count it. Make that 49. Still, Taliban has had a tight grip of this lead, but still close if CND can find some offensive rhythm. Try to come back with it. Marvin Worthy, a little hesitation move and passes out now with Samir. Samir, cross over. Oh, that's a great move, but you got to finish, young fella. Clean up crew. Couldn't get it done the first time, but it's actually Samir finishing the job, getting the points up there. Samir is crafty. He finds those holes under the basket. Just hasn't been able to convert here today. But go ahead, clean it up. Get your bucket nonetheless. That's what you got to get right now. We got a 12-point game currently. Zay with the ball here. Zay trying to show off the handle. Takes it, gets some space. And one. Draws the foul. And I was about to say, Zay, I was disappointed in him not going to the basket earlier, but he was just like, you know what? I want to dance, man. I want to dance. I need a partner to dance with. He said, come back here, young man, and let's have this dance. He goes ahead and gets the bucket and the foul, and he'll have some extra points to his total. He loves and to see it. a chip to, to the free throw line. There's a score currently 51 to 37. And they're just converting right now. You're seeing them getting into these spaces. Couldn't yeah, get that like one to fall, and we're going to have a foul going against CND. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be unworthy there. Loose ball foul. I don't know if it's actually going to be on Nas. But nonetheless. There's something I want to talk about here, right? I mean, we saw Northside yesterday. They had a full roster, I would say, right? CND today has a full roster. Free agency yesterday only had six to seven players. You look at Taliban here today, about eight, eight players. Out of the 11 that can be rostered. I think we talked about it before. I think less players might be better for you, Mass. I think in these situations, and Zay gets another basket to add to his total. How about Zay just didn't even think about hesitating on that one, just eyes to the basket at all cookies, time, and you. cookies the other oh, way. Oh, thank you. Oh, and who comes away with it? It's Twist, too fast with it. Pass it back up top, three-point shot. Couldn't convert, but Zay definitely finding his shot here in this third quarter. Hey guys. Again, the steal with the go the other way. Twist gonna show off Let's a fly. little bit. Let's Whoa. fly. Couldn't get it, though. You gotta be able to convert. Joe with the ball now, three-point shot. 
Just rushed it a little too soon. That one going out of bounds. And now I'm, and now I'm mad, right? Because again, that's another fast break opportunity. It's another opportunity to try to take a three instead of going to the basket. And you just got a lucky break. I mean, you saw a twist trying to show off and just gets caught by the rim. That should have been easy but points. You're down by 16. It's and they should be down by 18 breaks, right now. It's ridiculous, man. It's time to get points. It's time to get points. Get to the basket. Make better plays, man. This game was a 10-point game earlier. It was, it was down to six at one point. Unbelievable. Again, Spray coming back in, trying to crank up the heat a little bit. This ball is going outside, I believe, going CND way. And still, I, I cannot understand why we haven't seen Yuri back in this game. I, listen, man, I would, I would love to have a conversation with Coach. I mean, he's got a great great fit on right now. That pattern is, is unreal. I, I'm not going to lie to you. It's absolutely unbelievable. But that drip. Sure, we can call it that. We can call it that. He's got that drip on, you know what I'm saying? Just a different breed out here, man. Survival of the fittest. Sent with the ball here. Guarded by Zay. Some help defense coming over with Ron. Matt, that's going to end up being a kick ball as it hits off a twist, but arguably hits off his hip, which would not be a kick ball in yeah, my book, but yeah, nonetheless. I mean, he had a kick in motion, Yep. but he just didn't really get it off the hip. It was uh, more the top leg, but nonetheless still a kick, technically, because of the motion. I'll trust you on that one. A mid-range shot coming in from Bama, no good. It's going to be Ron on the board. Yeah, just a bad here. shot. Uh, I, I'm, I'm not going to shoot a coat. It's just, just a bad shot. And Vaughn coming in. He gets blocked. This ball going out. Some good defense. And CND is going to get that, as they say, that it hits off of Vaughn. But if you're going to play good defense, you got to convert on the other end, man. Let's go get some buckets, please. 53-37, four minutes remaining here in quarter number three here of game one, neighborhood versus neighborhood night two. Yeah, no, Since goes up when it gets blocked. Here's Vaughn the other way, taking flight. <laughs> and you saw a Twist trying to jam it in on the miss. And again, fast break three. Drive the ball, young fella, please. This ball ended up all the other way. And that's just going to be way too much time. But I At think they're up by 16. They're they are up by 16. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, if I'm Cindy, I got to call a timeout. And that's Cindy right. wanting a foul, but not that much on it. Twist the show right. off. And he said, I ain't missing this one. I got you. Yep, there you go. There's your timeout. Got to call it right there. And again, that should be, I, I'm not going to lie, this might be it, man. I think Taliban just sucked the life out of CND right there. I mean, well, unreal. How many times is CND going to take a transition three? They're not hitting. They're not When's hitting. the last time they hit a three? It just hasn't. You know what? Let's have a little segment here. Khalil's percentages. That's right. If we had to have a three-point percentage here today for CND, I got to be honest with you. It's got to be like maybe 2%. Hey, we got good vendors out here. I, I think they've maybe you one three out of 36. And if we talk about the free throw line, it might be even worse, Mass. They might be shooting worse than the free throw line than they are for the three point line. It's bad. It's really bad. I'm going to keep it 100 with you. Those numbers, you pulled them out of you nowhere. It's complete false, but I understand the point you make. Yeah, don't trust those percentages. Right, what do you think would be better? My percentages or your record? I'm going to go with my record. No, I don't think so. I know. I don't think so. You know what? Leave a comment down below. Who's got, who's got the better percentages? Hey, listen. We do want to hear from you. Uh, once again, NJ Hoop Crew, all abilities lab. Let us know who your favorite team is. Let us know who your favorite player is. Let us know who needs to be better or who's been impressing you. And let us know how you like in the commentary. And maybe somebody who hasn't played yet. Let us know who's a player to watch out for all across the league. Somebody we need to look out for. So it's going to be CND ball here. 321 remaining here in quarter number three. 55-37. And yes, if I'm not mistaken, I, heard, I think I did just hear Mike say that there is Jamaican food under the tree right next to the scoreboard. I had some catfish before. That was really good. Yeah, that was a we got food, We got good food all over here for sure. Now, That's a good hook pass coming from Bama. Oh, okay. We see you. Count it with it. 
not a great basket, right man. Right I can't lie to you. It's not a great basket. That's not a great basket? No. Are you kidding me? There's a look pass, and he actually gets to the roll. You, you, you're being too harsh right now. I need you to stop it. Keep coming up, gets the roll with it. That's a great bucket. That is a great bucket. That's a great bucket. But don't take it away from your last possession, my friend. Don't do it, brother. Please don't do it. Go the other way, and again, you can count it again. Marvel worthy back to back buckets. You gotta convert, right? I mean, the other thing doesn't have to be pretty. As long as you get the bucket, that's all that matters. I gotta convert that. And that's gonna be a travel coming in. I told y'all y'all gotta play some defense. Travel. We got 60 steps. We're not going on vacation. We're here at Brooksburg Park all summer, baby. We're not going to no New York. We're not going to no Pennsylvania. We're not going to Texas. We're not going anywhere. We're staying here in Jersey, bro. Stop yeah. traveling. I thought he uh, got some pressure from it. He, he, he wanted to take the extra step, but nonetheless, Wait, one more to Bama. Bama coming down in the Bama jam. That's what I like right there. Constant ball movement. Keep the ball open. And go right to the basket. Love that play. And Moose Money comes back into the game after a nice rest. Gonna go back up a run. RJ, deep three. No good. Look at the rebound coming in though from him. Run, bobbling it, gets it to go though. A strip coming the other way. CND stint gets that foul as Ron crashes into him. I gotta be honest with you, man. CND is starting to get a little bit of luck here. All you need is a few stops and just a few buckets right here. And this could be a totally different game. But you gotta take this momentum that you're having right now and bring it into the fourth quarter. Back to regular program. You got to also play some more defense. Defense is going to get you championships. You got to do it here today. You see them attack the basket now with Samba. Deep three coming. Up. And why are you doing that? I mean, it's just not falling. I know it's open, but you Ted Street, I mean, at least he comes back with some good defense. So I'll give it, but the big fellas is what's been your bread and butter on points. You just seen Bama link it up with Marvin Worthy. Go back to that. I don't get it, man. I'm bad now. I, I don't get it. Why Why do we keep taking the three? It's not falling. 2%, baby. 2% from three. Three-point land right now. Get to the basket. Moose money with it. Moose takes the three. Can't get it to fall. When you got offensive rebound like that, you good. And twist with the assist to the dunk for Big Ron. Pump taking a dime. Easy money between the two best players on Taliban right now. Brandon going to pass out with Bama. Bama okay. coming cross key, trying to get a pass back down to Worthy. That has some good chemistry. That's going to be. Yeah, it looks like they don't know what they're doing out there, man. Not gonna lie. They look like they're all over the place. They got to keep the ball in check. You got to get this ball movement in check, man. They're all over the place. Stay on your side. Uh -huh. Since, though, taking, you heard the slap, but they don't call it. Doesn't come in. And off of Worthy's head, going the other way, spray. Oh, and spray draws the foul. But I got to be honest, I would have liked to see him throw that up to Ron. I think Ron could have hit us with a back scratcher. I do think those C and D played that well that back pass, they were waiting on it. And then unless I think a foul was the best scenario for City, right? Make him earn it at the line. To be honest though, I didn't see Matt down there. Ron definitely got the height advantage in this game. But nonetheless, they got the foul, and they're up right now, so who am I? Yeah. 103 here in the third, and spray shot is good. 60 to 43. 17-point gap here. I mean, Taliban is absolutely taking over here today, man. Twist, LeBron. I, I think it's been a collective effort from downtown, and again, second chance points attacking the basket. That's been, that's been everything here today. Second shot is good from spray. And now Worthy trying to push the pace, but you gotta watch out when you got twists lurking in the wind. I mean, if, if, you gotta give it to a ball handler, Worthy. I can't lie to you. You got Synth right there. You got Samir. You got Brandy. You got so many other ball handlers. Why are you? Why do you have the ball in your hands? Just, just don't do that. Get the ball out of your hands. Brandon coming back with it. Gonna get it over with oh, Matt. Yeah. Matt trying to post up. They needed more of that. That look right there. Great baby hook shot. You see Matt's frustration right now. You see he's getting down the court slowly, starting to get tired, and twist is open from three. Oh, God, yeah, he can't shoot. Couldn't get it going. Can't shoot. Can't lie. See, and you hear the CND coach saying the exact same thing I am. Downtown, he just hasn't been in for a twist today. 
Brandon gonna draw the foul. And you know, you talk about that frustration they saw on Matt's face, and I can't blame him. He's, he's really been the most efficient player, maybe on the court, with the touches that he's been given, but his team's just not been picking him up. Yeah, I mean, they've been getting to the basket, they've been getting good looks, they just can't finish. I think that's been the moral of the story. I, I don't think Matt has had, you know, bad looks. I think he's had great looks, but he's just converting. That's the difference between the entire team. And I mean, again, everybody's had good looks from downtown as well. They just can't knock it down. The free throw percentage is still going down. Yeah. shot missed. Again, these, these teams that can shoot from downtown, oh, they, they, they could also way. fold on you, right? I mean, if you're not knocking it down, it's going to hurt you. But if you are, man, you can blow six. these teams out of the wall. I'm telling you right now, if I'm a coach and we haven't been here with in that first half, stop doing that three until you start making the shots. You got to get his closer back in. Ron coming the other way with the outlet. It's way too open. Way too much. You see Matt trying to make him hesitate, but he goes to the left hand on the finish. Smart decision from Ron. I think he's too tired, man. And out there all game. It's hot out here. Brandon now. Oh, the moose good. money on top of him. Gonna pass it over with Worthy. Worthy take it on. Twist. Go Tries to go through twist. a reverse. Great defense. Come on, ends up with it. Seconds. And there's five Four. seconds with it. Three. Let's see what Spray Four. can do as he splits it. And the block coming from Matt. And that's gonna end the quarter. 63-45. As we're about to enter the last quarter here in game number one. Taliban still on top, 63-45. They got that lead in the first, and they have not looked back. And CND still with a lot of ground to make up with. The door's not closed, but it is not looking likely. Oh, it's definitely not open. No, 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 I can't lie to you, it's not open. I mean, Taliban is absolutely taking over this game. I mean, just like they're there, taking over what they need to take over. You see what Twist is doing out here. You see what Ron's doing. RJ, Spray, E, Ron, Zach, Moose, Money. All of them are just letting it fly from downtown. And they are converting. They're getting the basket. They're playing defense. They don't look like they're lighting up. They're relentless out here. Look great. That's going to be a problem. It's going to be a problem. 63 points on the plan. Three points. It's solid. Back after, here we go with it. And almost getting caught up with Ron's screen is spray. Oh my god, he gets him breaking ankles a little bit. Ron coming through a big block coming from Bama. Great way to come back on that, though. Great way to come back. Look at the ball movement now. I like what I'm seeing here. And Yuri back in the game. Swiss gets blocked by Ron. I would love the right hand floater right there. Clear defender. Got to go with the right hand. Swiss. Look, it's a contortion of the body. That man belongs at the circus. Yeah, it's just these, these awkward ways to go up. You don't see it coming, and he just converts, man. What a different breed. Matt, back up top. Swiss with the Joe. Can't get it to fall. Joe going to keep it, though. On the tip out. Survey. Yeah, Joe keeps shooting, man, but he might be 0 for 20 today. Oh, but Matt's got to finish that. That is a great pass coming from Joe. And they just are not converting, man. Twist taking flood. Can't get it to fall, but there's Ron coming through. My name is Twist. I'm the owner of the suit. Shut up. Keep it 21. If I sit on that sideline, I ain't got to scream my name. Bring the ball up. Take that shit. Yeah, <laughs> 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 
number two and one. Mother, <laughs> you know I mean? We outside. What? 20 point ball game. Too bad, Zizi. 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 Too I'm gonna come in for Moose Money. We're gonna get spray at the free throw line. Eight ten remaining in this contest. Sixty nine forty seven. This one right here getting a little out Favor of the yellow squad. Missing the shot. We got Swizz coming the other way. We outside. Swiss gonna pass it on over. Good pump fake. Good pass. Bama down low on Vaughn. Help defense coming in. Oh, I saw a foul before a trap. With the bump with it. And it's an and one. But nonetheless, hey, a bucket's a bucket, right? And the contact comes with it. He's headed to the But you know what? As we said, come back unlikely. But scoring with, that, with the clock coming, with no clock coming off. Something I want to talk about on the Taliban side, though. They don't even look tired. That's They're out here just open, man. They just look wrong. Look at wrong. He's been in the game the entire time, and he doesn't look tired. They look unfazed. This is just no competition for them right now. I want to see some competition. Because Taliban is going to be a problem in this tournament, in this league, man. They're going to be an absolute problem. And I can't wait to see them match up against AM, man. I want to see them match up against some heavy hitters, man. Taking it all the way, Zay. Can't get it to go, but Ron. Ron coming with it, trying to go reverse. But the ball falls back to him. He's going to take a wide open three. Big fella can't convert, though, but that's all right. Because they got a 20 point lead. Ron's just taking three. They're just passing around at this point. You run out around the contest and you get out in front of those laps. What is going on? Yuri. Okay, Yuri. Shot is a shot. Okay, Yuri should have been in the game a while ago, man. Should have been in the game a while ago. He's part of that mismatch, that big fella mismatch. There's, there's really only one big man on this Taliban squad, and that's Ron. You got to combat that by bringing in more power and more muscle. That's it. Can't get it to go, but Ron again with the hustle board. Again, the hustle. For Taliban right now. The second chance was we said when the game first started. The second chance points are gonna add up. The free throws that you missed are gonna add up. And again, that's what Taliban has done here today. They've converted on their free throws. They've gotten second chance points. They've done everything that they needed to do, man. Again, a scary team, a definitely a team to watch out for. We outside, ladies and gentlemen. We outside the middle. Coming back up with it. We outside. Yo, passing it over. Yo, Yuri doing work since checking back in the game. Nice floater, good footwork. Let me see some. Let me see some. Back the other way. Twist with Bama on. I'm going to pass out of it. Shot from Heave, no good. And Ron coming in. That's going to stay. That's winning basketball right there. That's, that's hustle, man. Winning basketball. Hustle. Winning basketball. Get into the basketball. Make your play. Go out there and play. And look, you're getting the ball back right there in a situation where maybe you shouldn't have gotten the ball back. That would be a bot. There's RJ with it. 14 seconds on the shot clock to work with. Ron, 10 seconds now. Gonna take a deep two. No good. Look at the offensive hustle coming in. And Ron ends up in a perfect position because Ball puts in effort. We got 20 rebounds here today, man. I mean, this guy just gets to the basket like nobody else. He's fighting for every board. Offensively, defensively, it doesn't matter. He's doing 
And still, the, the effort, they can't there, but it's not finishing. They gotta be able to finish. Joe finally, finally connect. scoring from three. That 10% has come in now. 10% for downtown. 5.38 on the clock. 71 to 56. And he with the ball, he loses it. Joe taking it the other way. Nice crossover coming back in, trying to switch. Foul. We're heading to the charity line. Again, these points matter, right? You're down by four. Five minutes left. You still got time, man. You still got time. Again, it only takes a few threes, man. But you got to hit him. Joe, he's got to get hot. You see him in that corner hitting that shot. Maybe that's a heat check for him. Maybe that's a little momentum shift for him. But you don't have a lot of time. You got to be able to convert and get stopped. Huge integral part. Joe's first shot. Oh, man. Again, costly, man. Free throws have just been costly. They, they, they converted their free throws. This, I think they're only down by eight. They're only down by eight? I mean, one free throw. See those fast break opportunities they have. They clearly went away after a while, man. They don't stick around that long. You got to be able to convert in those scenarios. And again, that's why the gap is what it is. Joe's second one is good. 57-53. And now CND is. The time is, was yesterday. They got to get going. And now CND is 25% from the free throw line. Khalil's percentages. Coming back with it. Twist. Jump ball. Jump ball. Well, that's a great call. Right good hand from Joe. Shout out to that ref, man. That's a great call. He's been making great calls all night over there. Shout out to him, man. It's not an easy job. 77, 77. Shout out my man Mike running this event with the MC and down lab. Setting up chairs, setting up the banners. My man doing all down here, hooking me up with the water, keeping us hydrated. Keeping us hydrated. We got snacks down here. We, we got drinks. What do you need? Good food. Down here, neighborhood versus neighborhood. The other way, sip. Again, just can't get it. Twist. Get the outlet pass. Just too easy. Arch your open shot. No good, though. You see how quick Ron was going out there and trying to fight. I mean, he's fighting for every single opportunity. But again, another fast break opportunity. And you just being selfish. It's just selfish. I'm not going to lie. I, I'm not going to sugarcoat it. It's just selfish. Pass the ball. It's not hard. Pass the ball and get this team going, man. There's not a lot of time left to be, you know, messing around. It's time to go. Let's go. Let's make this a game. 14 on the shot clock. Matt, short time. 10 seconds over to Joe. Passes down low, strip coming in. Spray getting his fingers on in there. Twist. Nice job of hanging on to it. And RJ missed the last attempt, but makes that one. He's giving him too much time to spot up. It is a money spot, man. I'm not gonna lie, I'm getting a few shots from that wing right there, man. It's a money spot. Come on, man. Sid, out to Swiss, Swiss. That's a great response. Nailing it in. 14 point game. For four minutes, they gotta keep on He's gotta start on defense here, RJ. Getting some pressure. Deep three. Tank is open. Oh, man, MVP. Oh, he's stealing it. Okay. He's stealing the tongue. So you know somebody's stealing it. He's like, okay. Okay. I'm starting to feel it. Give me the ball. Let me go to work. Swiss trying to get back. Swiss coming right back at it. It's too much length coming. I appreciate Swiss, but just like Poppy last night, Jack. Travel. Travel. Step there. We're not on vacation, bud. We're here at Bracebrook all, all summer. We outside, baby. All As I was saying, you saw with Poppy yesterday. You see it with Swiss in this game. They're quick. They got handles. They are shorter players on the court, though. You got to adjust for that height. That first move getting past them is great, but they keep a cover on you when they got the length and height like that. You got to watch. Again, somebody that's not that tall, I understand that, right? You're trying to be so quick and finish with your left and right hand. You're too quick for your own butt. There you go. Easy. Oh, they, 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 they just can't get it to fall. It's not fall, man. You don't have enough balance in here. You get the hang time, but you can't, you know, separate the hang time and your timing with the basket, man. It's hard. It is rough out here for sure. Spray 
with the three. No good. Swiss taking it the other way. Gonna give the Sith back to Swiss. No left spot. No good. Sith grabs it. Swiss says, two for a dollar. Cash it in on it. 77 63. Again, those are the shots that make you feel a little better, right? I mean, step into the shot a little bit. Stop and pop. He didn't really stop. He was running on the first one. Able to stop. Get his shot. Get the dunk. Pass over to Ron. Ron. Twist in the center. And they're going to go to travel. I stand corrected. I stand corrected. Uh -huh. But nonetheless, I mean, two minutes and 35 minutes. Across. Definitely going to be tough for CMB to come back now. But nonetheless, Taliban right now. They look great. They look great. But they also look a little composed, right? I mean, you're up by this much, you feel good. They do look a little complacent, though. They got to keep converting. You got two minutes, just got to end it out. You've had the lead. Don't give it up now. And the three ball had a recent success with the last couple of yesterday. They lifted and died by it today. Three ball did not lift today. They died by it. Sometimes that's going to happen, right? I mean, if that's your scheme and that's your play style. You, you got to die, live and die by your play style. And that's exactly what you get here today. Both coaches upset about it, but at the end of the day, maybe they convert on these and get a different game, right? Out of there. Yeah. So Zay uh -huh. getting hounded by Samir. Coming, losing the ball. Good hand going out of bounds. And this ball is going to stay with the gold squad. That yellow yeah, he, didn't, he, didn't, he didn't account for the, the little uh, post right there, I would say. Right there. Uh, what would you call that? Is that really a post? Or is that like, like a, a, what would you call that? A statue? Or is it? A pillar. A pillar. There you go. You, know, you, you watch a lot of like, you, you're a big You know what it is. Oh my, that's big man ball right there. Akeem Olajuwon would have been proud of that thing. Shake the right hand. This might be the dagger, man. This might be the dagger. Just under two minutes. Swiss three off the back eye. Offensive board coming from Marvin Worthy. Back out again. Swiss can't get it. Good offensive boards, though. Swiss a third time. Count it. You know who Swiss plays like? Brandon Jennings. He plays exactly like. Oh, oh, hold on, Zay. Okay. Okay, Zay. But Zay just looks unfazed, right? I mean, he just looks locked in. He's going to the final place. Oh, my. Swift. They needed that earlier on, though. 81 68. 15. Too much. Too late. Swiss. No good. Oh, man. Almost ripped the house down. Coming, Matt, lay it down low. And one. Count it. Okay. Maybe this one, you get it back to a 10 point gap. A minute left. Maybe you're going to quit stealing another three. We might be talking about something, man. It'll be a different story. I'm going to be honest, man. I mean, Swiss is going to be the guy here for CND. I think he is the real guy here for the top four, man. Shifty can hit that step back three. It looks like you just need the reason general. Definitely can attack your basket. Just got to be working on the finishing a little more. And he's going to be a player to look out for here all league long. They need this free throw bad here, man. Oh, one minute left in this one. Don't forget, we got two crew taking on Zone 6 NYC in the game number two. All right, so we got to finish this one out here. And man, you want to talk about the real MVP of the game. It's been twisted. Yeah. Offense supports, hostile effort, unguardable. 80% of his touches, it feels like. The only weakness in his game was the deep ball. But let's be honest, he was kind of just coasting in those moments because they had the 20 point lead at that time. And also, he hasn't been out of the game here today, right? He continues to fight, continues to get the second chance points, and he's able to convert, man. Shout out, my boy. Shots by Cozy in the building. And Samir, the deep three, no good.
Matt saving it. We have 40 seconds though. 13 points in. I think that's it. Next two teams get ready. Shoot up. Zone 6. Gotta give it. The Taliban, they came in. They control the entire way. And still not giving up. Twist going coast to coast with it. My man just took us all the way from the north. Hey. To Los Angeles. My apologies. I'll, I'll tell you, Swiss's speed is probably. Oh, he's nice, man. No, he's speed. absolutely crafty, man, but he just can't get the finishing down today. That's all it is. It's all about finishing. RJ out for three. And back scratching dunk. That's the nail in the coffin. CND.